Parker. Tonight, the UVA community and the Commonwealth came together to remember the lives of Lavelle Davis Jr., Deshaun Perry, and Devin Chandler, all three full of life, whose lives are, who live, excuse me, on in the hearts of others. Connor Dietrich is in Charlottesville tonight with their story. What a beautiful service to honor the lives of these three young men. I spent some time walking around and a lot of people embracing each other. And one thing I heard over and over again is everything will be okay. We're going to fight and we are going to get through this. Most Saturdays spent in Charlottesville are inside Scott Stadium. Only this Saturday, there was no game. There were no fans. Instead, an arena filled with Cavalier blue and orange a community of Who's gathering to celebrate the lives of Devin Chandler, Deshaun Perry, and Lavelle Davis Jr. A team without their brothers, students losing their friends, families grieving for their sons. They were kind, they were funny, they were full of energy, they were serious students, they were sons and grandsons and brothers. The pain is still settling in for many. Today, some players sharing their reflections on the lives of their teammates. Everyone here is forever in your hearts. Lavelle, Devin, and Deshaun. And I know that they would want us to keep going and to push forward and cherish the love and memories that we have of each and every one of them. Each one of these players were equally important to one person, Coach Tony Elliott. Because of one, 15, 41, we have the responsibility to rebuild this community and program on the legacy of their stars. Moments like these are never easy, but it's moments like these that are more important than the game. One of the other special things about this memorial is it not only honored the lives of the three men lost, but also honored the fight that is still going for the other two students wounded, including running back Mike Hollins. Reporting in Charlottesville tonight, Connor Dietrich, 10 News, working for you.